Trinity happens to be one of my favorite frames because it has two different builds that are quite the opposites. The first build is the Blessing Link combo. Blessing and Link both benefit from duration and don't suffer from power strength. So you'll be stacking over extended stretch natural talent to boost the speed of Blessing casts. Continuity, Constitution, more duration. Narrow minded for even more duration, being countered by the stretch and overextended. And she has her other build, which is, I believe, the highest single target damage in the game possible. Excluding. No, it is the highest. Uh, with this, you'll be using Energy Vampire, Blessing, and Well of Life. Well of Life will keep a target alive infinitely with Energy Vampire if you cast Energy Vampire first and then you well it. So that way it takes hardly any damage in its percent increase from Well of Life. Well of Life gives them a percent increase in their health so they shouldn't die. And then you can just chain Well and Energy over and over again. Natural Talent makes it so you can cast Energy Vampire like a Railgun on targets if you have a Rhino and Nova in your party giving you a huge damage boost. The Energy Vampire is basically slash damage so it does even in more damage on pretty much everything. Blind Rage, Folk, or Intensify now. Both really great. Boosts the damage in Energy Vampire like crazy. You don't want continuity constitution on this build, you want fleeting expertise at max because energy vampire does not lose power with a shorter duration, it actually keeps its strength at 20% or whatever percent it is health after all the modifiers. So you'll do 4 ticks of more than their health. As long as you have that Rhino and Nova of course. Blessing is just here to heal it only has a 4 second immunity with this build. Uh, with the Blessing build you're going to use the Aura Trinity Helmet and with the Energy Vampire build you'll throw on the regular helmet. 